Hey everybody, this is the fourth here, and in this video I'll be showing you how to open zipped loop package project files um, in FL Studio. So a lot of times when you download a project file um, online, it might be in a zipped loop package because that way it includes all the different samples and stuff pretty easily. Uh, so you know if you download any Beat School Essentials project files, those will be in zipped loop packages. And, you know, they're really pretty nice, and I will show you how to, you know, open those up in this video. So there are a couple different ways uh, to open them. The first is, if you already have FL Studio open, you can just go File, Open, and then, you know, find that project file, uh, the zip file, and just select to open that, and it should open up everything pretty well. But um, another way, kind of a faster way, is if you don't have FL Studio open, um, but you have you know the folder open with that zip file in it, the project file, you can right click that project file and go to open with and select FL Studio Launcher. And you know, this will also open up that zipped loop project um, and all the samples, everything should be in there. Um, so it's really pretty nice. Um, so yeah, that's how you can open up these zipped loop packages in FL Studio. Um, occasionally you might have problems with some of the samples um, because you have a sample in your library that is the same name as that sample. Uh, this happens most often with dragged samples. Um, and if that does happen, you know, I'll, I'll show you how you can correct that um, right now. So you can hear that if I play this part of the song right here, um, things aren't going to sound quite right. Um, and that's supposed to be kind of a hard style kick. Um, but instead it, you know, just doesn't sound right. And so the problem is dragged sample 40. And you can see that in my library, you know, I have a dragged sample 40 already. And so instead of taking the one from the zipped loop package, it has taken the one from my library. Um, so this should be a hardstyle kick, but instead it's... You know, um, a guitar sample. So to correct that, all you have to do is go into the zip loop um, package. Um, I'm going to open that in a new window. And then you want to find drag sample 40 or whatever you know sample it is that is um, incorrect. And you want to extract that from the zip file. So just you know drag it and drop it. Um, you can see I've already done that here. And then once you have that, all you have to do is you know, take that in FL Studio and replace the waveform. Um, you know, replace the waveform of the incorrect sample with the correct one. And now you can see when I play this, it is Yeah, you know, it's the hard style kick. So, you know, if any of the samples get replaced with one of um, the samples in your library because it has the same name, uh, that's all you have to do. You just have to extract the sample from the zip loop package and then, um, you know, 
drag it into the project file to replace the incorrect sample. So that's pretty much it. That's how you can open up um, zipped loop packages in FL Studio and how you can correct any uh, sample mistakes, you know, any samples being um, replaced by ones from your library instead of ones from the zipped package. Uh, hopefully that was helpful and I will see you in the next video.